I think I have a complete refill for all the coal that I just lost. What else does a man need than coal and his wooden pickaxe to make it for the day? That is definitely correct, in my opinion. I should probably not be digging while I'm right under this, because I am right next to gravel. <laughs> and that could fall in on my head at any point in time, and that would not be a healthy ending either. Never um, forget that there's, there's one way to rescue yourself. Just, like, start digging like crazy to the top if you get buried beneath <laughs> gravel. Sometimes it can save lives. All right, let's... Let's get some of this stone so that I can make some stone pickaxes when I'm I don't want to be mean, but I'm really looking forward to the next night. Yeah? You, you want me to uh, meet up with zombies and everyone else out here? Nah, oh. a creeper would be just fine. <laughs> <laughs> You're an evil, evil person sometimes. No, I just treat all creatures equal, and they just want food just like you want food. Ooh, they have a look, right even more exist. coal. I See, like this you area. You destroyed a poor mountain for coal. You are very evil. The poor mountain has a right to exist just like you, and you just destroyed with your bare hands. <laughs> yes, well, I I am uh, kind of kind of red right now. Maybe I'm Chris Redfield. <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> Maybe well, that that's was, what I, mean, I am. What's the connection to a mountain then? I I knew it. I knew it. I can punch rock. I am totally Chris Redfield oh, right now. That, yeah, that I have sense. just figured out who Red is. I have figured not, everything out. Steroids yet. <laughs> it all makes sense. I have figured everything out. Indeed. Wow. That is impressive. I, I never knew that before. That uh, Red was actually Chris Redfield. I wonder if Claire is here somewhere. <laughs> All right, let's let's go about building some torches and a house. That sounds like a good course of action at this point. Whoops, what am I doing? <clears throat> I'm trying to refine wood in the wrong way. That's what <laughs> I'm doing. Okay. Whoops. There's one thing you maybe should know about a nice little place called Hell I told you about. There's like a little glitch that likes to happen in that world, so uh, I maybe some people will be angry that I give this away <laughs> because they would like to see you suffer, but I'm not going to be that mean. If you go into hell and you die, there's a chance that you won't be able to get back all the items you had when you passed away. Well, It's sort of like a glitch that's still existent. So if you go there, um, either go there empty-handed on your first, I don't know, excavation or journey or just, yeah... Just put it somewhere and be careful about it. Well, you know, I, I try to put my items away in in treasure chests and so forth. Well, I suppose they're not a treasure chest if you make it yourself. But um, I try to put my stuff away in two chests, um, which was seen in the first time when I played this game. Um, wherever that uh, wherever that location is currently. Um, so somewhere out there, there is a chest full of stuff that I <laughs> that I got, and I don't Maybe know where it in is. In a few centuries, somebody <laughs> will dig it up. <laughs> uh, I'm sure it's I'm sure it's out here somewhere. I'm just not sure quite where it is. And the sun is beginning to go down. I really like how Yay. they've updated the uh, the sun in this uh, this new patch version here. Okay, and anyways. Yeah, definitely props to the creator. Looks yeah. very nice. I should probably start building myself a little uh, little bunker up here before things start to get dicey. Um, and let's also put some torches around just so that we have a little bit of protection while I'm building this. I guess I'll build it partially out of dirt and partially out of other things that I have in my pack right now. Whoops. I didn't want to move this all the, the way over here. The creepers are coming. They They're are waiting coming. for you. I know and they, they are. They want to be with you, and are coming to get you forever. Oh great! Anyway, um, hopefully they. By won't the way, be I'm not. I'm not trying here. to be mean. I'm just trying to enhance the mood a little bit. <laughs> Those damn creepers! Oh, um, I forgot to say that. Um, 
shadow cookie here probably won't be here for the entire recording because he does have to go a little bit earlier than um, I will have to go since he is in um, Germany while I am not. Um, I think I will. Damn probably... those time differences. <laughs> I think I will probably start making some ladders and digging down into this place. <laughs> well, but I'm pretty sure this won't be the last time of like a little co-commentary. Yeah, yeah, I plan to do um, co-commentary once in a while with various people while I'm playing this game. So, um, if you're interested in co-commentary, I may allow you to be on this. We'll see. We'll see how that works out, but um, for the moment, I'm going to make some ladders if I could uh, remember what I'm doing, which is highly unlikely because I always forget what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't know why I forget what I'm doing so much, but I do. Um, okay, that's that seems like a good bit of ladders. We'll get four <coughs> more. Your Maybe. little hideout here reminds me of something that uh, happened to me once on a map. It's like also like a little structure, sort of like walls. And then the next morning I look over the walls and it's like an entire army of spiders and creepers <laughs> all jumping up, desperately trying to get in. And the problem is like they won't go away because, you know, creepers and that sort of stuff, uh, they don't like disappear when it uh, goes day, if they have seen you during the night. And then it's like they all crowd out there and they just won't go away and they keep getting more and more and it's just, oh my god, <laughs> leave me alone. <laughs> I'm sure that's probably going to happen up here, but honestly, I'm going to dig straight down and probably never come up here again. Uh, the only thing that's good up here is going to be this box and these torches which will hopefully prevent you're things doomed. from you're doomed if anything spawning. manages to get inside all right now this you've got no, me worried this is um no house. This is a food cage okay um i'm going to remove these torches and then i'm going to brick this place up because now i'm <laughs> i'm worried better safe than sorry yes um Get a little bit more of this dirt so I can cover up the rest of the place. And I'll break this. Okay, I wanted to break this, but it didn't quite work. <laughs> First example of magic. Oh wait, that's super glued to the wall. <laughs> Alright, now, now I will We'll break up this place and say goodbye to the outside world for the moment. <laughs> and hopefully nothing will get me in here. We'll just put some more torches just in case. Um, alright. So let's start digging this hole that I want to make. Um, and I don't like dirt in my hole. So there we go. Let's... Start I don't know if this. I should like mention something about the uh, uh, little LP test I showed you yesterday because I really don't want to use your videos as advertisement for myself. <laughs> that is fine. You're you're <laughs> on the video and I don't mind uh, mind whatsoever. Well, I um, guess since there, I mean, this is not like a video where you need to pay all attention to a story because there is no story. <laughs> not really. Not really. Well, I, I will make up one soon. <laughs> <clears throat> maybe that's a, maybe that's the first thing I should do. So yeah, the story of this game is very simple. Frozen Foxy sadly passed away in real life. I know it's sad, but it couldn't be helped. He like, I don't know, um, he ate too many donuts. That sounds plausible, and he just couldn't take it anymore. And eventually for his sins, he did not go to either heaven or hell. He was stuck in limbo. And well, he looked around, there was nothing to see, it was just like an endless place with, with rivers, with everything, but it just wouldn't end. No matter how far he would travel, it would go on for all of eternity. Eventually he was so desperate and exhausted that he fell onto his knees and wanted to cry. But then a voice in his head said, Mortal, look down to your feet. And the frozen fox, he looked to his feet and there was a block. Indeed, it was a block. Frozen Foxy couldn't believe it. And on this block, it was like a little inscription that said, And on the eighth day, the Lord created the block, and he saw that it was good. <laughs> the voice would never speak again, but Frozen Foxy didn't need it. For that sentence showed him the one truth, 
and the one meaning. He didn't need any more understanding about this place, it was all so simple and clear all of a sudden. He would never die, this was his domain. He had the power of the blocks, and he could create whatever he wanted to create for all of eternity. And that's the story for this game, we will be stuck here in limbo for all eternity. I think I found the outside world, and this doesn't seem to be a very, very large mountain area here. Because, um, <clears throat> wherever I go, there's dirt all around me. <laughs> maybe want to take, maybe want to take a peek inside out of that, like, where the dirt with the grass, like, is laying, just to see what's going on outside. Hello? Um, I, I can't see, a see big anything pile out of there. dark nothingness. Yeah, I can't see a thing out there. Well, I see a tree, I believe. Could be a tree. Yeah, that's a tree. <laughs> Woo, a tree. All special. right, well, I think I will um, avoid that for now. If I had some sand, I would make a window over there, but I don't currently have any sand, so I guess I'll have to worry about that later. Well, Actually, I might want to make a door. Make a furnace. Yes, that too. I think I'll make a door, actually, and put it right there. Uh, let's see, where is my box? My box is in my inventory. Why did I come back up here? <laughs> I don't care about some coming work, up here. Some workout. <laughs> All the nice and peaceful calm music while exploding beings and giant man-eating spiders roam the place. This place beautiful. is dangerous, and it's it's going to kill me someday. It killed you a lot of times already. It's gonna kill me permanently someday. Oh um, my god, oh my god. I believe I saw something. Was there something? I don't know. I don't know if there was something out there. I'm sure there probably <laughs> it looks like was. like there was something right to the left. I don't know. It looked like it. Hello? Hello? Oh my god. Maybe I was just Ooh. being paranoid, but... Oh, I see be stuff careful. Outside it's, my not door. Worth the risk. it's not worth the risk. Stay inside. I see stuff outside my door. Which I want to get. You will regret it. I am warning you. I am warning you. Hello? The coal is not worth it, you fool. <laughs> is there anything out here? Hello? Wow. I am Something on a sheer cliff. Down. Oh, wait a minute. It's getting daytime. Oh, I'm surprised that I dug out almost exactly on ground level. That's, that's <laughs> pretty, pretty impressive nice. because I was all the way up there before. That that is actually fairly impressive. I did not expect to dig out right here. I must get this coal. It beckons to me. <laughs> I can't resist the coal. Coal, coal, a castle, no a kingdom for coal. Is there anything behind me? Okay. <clears throat> I gotta check because you know those things can sneak up on you, which has yeah. been uh, shown multiple times already. Yeah, and I lost all my iron how for it. The enemy can be. They're kind of like Sam Fisher, except very green. <laughs> except Sam Fisher does not explode. <laughs> he might explode. He might have like an installed self-destruct system or something. Oh, I don't I know. Like that. Ooh, an egg. Oh, what do you know? Give me that. Well, I have my just first egg. <laughs> I think I will just keep that egg in my inventory. Oh my god, someone's shooting at me. You ass! Oh, that's nothing. <laughs> the egg, it was just that hilarious outside. And now you will pay for your curiosity. You burn! Burn! <laughs> Go back to hell whence you came. Ow! How did he shoot through that window? Go back to the shadows. You jerk. He shot right through my window. Did you see that? I've never seen a skeleton shoot through a window before. Well, nobody ever, uh, like, established uh, what skill a skeleton has. In yeah, being I suppose a not. Maybe someone should write that down in Wikipedia on the skeletons. <laughs> skeletons have been known to be very precise and skilled sharpshooters when it comes to uh, the use of a bow and arrow. <laughs> 